On level 20, you unlock the wires layer and the quad painter. To access the wire layer, the default bind is E. As you can see, you start off with the two different colors of wires, which allows you to place them beside each other. You also have the wire crossing, which lets you send signals over each other. And you have the belt reader, which was previously unlocked, but as the, the way the belt reader works is when you have an input into it, it will display what is being inputted and if the belt is flowing. So as you can see, this is zero because it's stopped. If we trash this, it becomes a one. And finally, the quad painter. The quad painter is a variant of the painter, but it allows you to specify what corners you want painted by using the wires. So let's show that now. If we take the quad painter, we input the colors, and let's get the shape input. As you can see, there's this symbol. That means that there are no, there's no signal connected to it. So what we have, that what we start off with, is buttons. Now buttons you can place on either layer, and you can turn them on and off like this. So the way to do this is you can hook each button into, as you see, the quad painter has four inputs. So we can hook each button. Actually, I'll move this down one. We'll get four buttons. Each button hooked into uh, each input. We can use the different colors of wires. There we go. So as you see, it, the, ch the signal changed. Before, it was like no wires plugged in. Now it's just no signal. Because what buttons do is it determines what corners will be uh, painted. So any uh, of the quad painter inputs that are one will be painted. So let's say blue. If blue is one, as you see, now we get this blue circle, right? And we can enable red like this. Now we have red and blue and green and then red again. And we have the full shape.